Hello and welcome to this week's Trade of the Week on Monday, the 9th of September 2024. At the end of August, we went short Arabica coffee futures because we had triple negative divergence on our weekly and daily relative strength index. And you can see that here we have a series of lower highs compared to a series of higher highs with regards to the April, July, and also August highs here on the Arabica coffee futures chart. Now, since then, um, we are in profit by about 67%. This trade out worked out really well so far. So what you can now do is lower your stop to either our entry level, which was around 254.75, I believe, or uh, so, and uh, thereby we have a potentially risk-free trade on, or you can lower it to the last reaction high that was made on Thursday of last week, so just above 248.13, thereby you have a profit stop, so you'll still make a profit if you get dropped out. But our downside target is still in play, and I've let this one run personally, but that's really up to you. Last week, we did a similar trade. Orange Juice Futures were making an all-time record high, and basically you can see here uh, that the high made in August was similar to the one in May, but we had a lower high on the relative strength index. Again, negative divergence, so I wanted to go short. But we actually got stopped out on that one because we have a very tight stop above the record high here at 488. So we got stopped out on that one and lost 2% of our trading capital because here at trading the week, a trade of the week, we always risk 2% of capital per trade. And now this week's uh, trade of the week, what we want to do is actually trade in the direction of the trend. You can see here we have a series of lower highs and lower lows, which is the definition of a downtrend. And it looks to me as if we are now resuming the downtrend again but we need to have a wide stop, which I would like to place above this resistance area going back to the February and March and April lows and also the July high between 11th, uh, 1,130 and 1,144. So that uh, would be our stop above that area just in case it were to continue to rise in the short term. This week's trade of the week is to go short soybean futures with a stop loss at 1,150 and a downside target at around 910.